Hey, it's your biggest fan here, Denver 51, bringing you some gameplay on Nuke Town 2012. Uh, see what I did there. And I'm here to kind of talk about Nintendo. And what? Nintendo? You haven't spoken about Nintendo in months. <laughs> yes, I know. Um, but they recently announced that partners on YouTube can't earn uh, can't earn revenue on their gameplay. And I'm kind of split between this because one, on one side, you know, it doesn't really affect those non-partner people who don't earn money on YouTube and who just kind of play the game, blah blah blah. But on the other kind of spectrum, I'm thinking to myself, well, Nintendo were giving up free promotion. Like, if someone on YouTube is playing your game and have a wide audience, they're obviously going to be partnered, especially in this day and age on YouTube. And if they're going to be partnered, they want to earn money. And earning money is more of a bonus than anything on YouTube because it get it gets it gets you going. You know, it it keeps you going. It makes you produce kind of better content. Imagine if every video you watched was in 144p. Like, and if you haven't seen 144p, then you know you're lucky. <laughs> it's really bad. But imagine, imagine playing games in 144p, and that's because uh, some partners or, or free-to-play players, they, maybe they can't, they don't have enough money to produce that sort of stuff. But for me, I'm thinking, well, Nintendo, you're giving up free promotion because big YouTubers with uh, a, a big fan base, you know, they're gonna want to see that. If they see their bigger YouTubers playing these games, they're gonna be like, wow, I, I'm a bit more interested in that game. I might actually buy it. Of course. Um, I do agree to an extent that people shouldn't upload Nintendo to gameplay. For example, I know this isn't, I know LA New Art isn't a Nintendo game, but it's just an example. Like LA New Art and Rockstar, they didn't allow people to upload to YouTube. Period, it, whether they earned money or not, and that's simply because um, because it was a mystery game. And mystery games, uh, if you watch it online, you know you're only mystery games are like a one-time thing. You know, you either watch it online. Or, or you play it online, and the experience would basically be the, be the same, only when you play it, it's a lot more personal. So, when LA, when like Rockstar said you can't really earn, you can't really show anything on YouTube, people were like, fair enough, you know, you have your reasons, and that's, re that's reasonable enough, because if people watch that video, they may not necessarily buy the game afterwards, and that's kind of losing potential customers. However, with Nintendo, the, the potential customer... It, it's like they're giving away free promotion. If I made a game, I, w I wouldn't mind people making videos, even earning money off my videos. And you see me get my dogs there. Yeah, I wouldn't mind people even earning money off my videos, just because it's it's not a bad thing. You get more promotion, and the thing is, like, especially when people look up, people look up uh, let's plays, they look up walkthroughs, they look up cheats, they look at hacks, they look at anything on YouTube, basically, involving games. And if your favourite commentator or favourite YouTuber just decides, well, I can't play your favourite game or, not, or I can't play my favourite game because one, uh, Nintendo have suddenly stopped me from earning money or have given me a strike on my channel or something like that, then they're going to spend less effort trying to entertain you guys or trying to produce videos that way and may focus on something else which is more beneficial. So when, for Nintendo to say something like, um... Uh, you, you can't earn money because, you know, I, I don't even understand the reason why you can't actually earn money, but the, the, the way they announced this was really out of the blue, and I think that th they've made a really silly mis uh, choice from, they've made a silly mistake announcing that you can't earn revenue, because I, I, what, what about, you know, videos like Mario Kart, you know, I like playing in massive groups, if other people see me playing in massive groups on, say, Mario Kart with a bunch of my friends having fun on Skype, then it's it's promoting the game, it's not anything bad, and if I can earn money on the side, then that only encourages me to produce more uh, more content, similar like similar content, and in better quality, you know, building a better audience. So it works both ways. But for Nintendo to say, nope, you can't earn money, it's it's kind of a... I don't know why that Nintendo don't want free promotion, especially in this day and age where the Wii, uh, the Wii U and 3DS aren't doing that great in sales. It's... It's just a bad move from Nintendo. Hopefully they change this in the past, or <laughs> the past? Hopefully they change this in the future, and better things will happen. And maybe other companies won't follow follow Nintendo's rules because I don't like seeing this kind of stuff. Anyway, during this gameplay, just wanted to tell you, um, the host does migrate in like a second here, 
So I checked the gameplay and it was 29 to 3, I believe. So it, it's quite a good score. Anyway, it's your, it's been your biggest fan here. Benefit you on. Bye. Oh, and don't forget to leave your comment in the.